Hi, I am here with Tony Clark, Director of Communications at Cedar Point. How are you doing today? I'm amazing. How are you? Fantastic. Having a cheesy day at the Wild Mouse? I wouldn't call it cheesy just yet. I mean, it's like a beautiful day. I was more excited about that than the, than the ride, to be honest with you. It's been raining here all week. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. Great day to, to let people ride for the first time. So what makes this spinning coaster unique? So this is a little bit different than some of the other Wild Mouse coasters that are out there, including our own that we had many years ago. And that's what this is. It's like a modern version of our old Wild Mouse. We wanted to bring something back from the past that had a modern version that was able to be purchased, of course. So uh, Zamperla uh, had this uh, twist, Twister Freeform coaster available, and we named it after our old Wild Mouse coaster. So it still has the hairpin turns that you would expect from a Wild Mouse, but then it's got the dips and turns that are unexpected, all while doing that 360 degree motion. And I think one of the coolest things about the ride is the logo because if you look in history and some of the pictures of our old Wild Mouse, it is that same logo, but we've given it that, that modern twist and a few nods to some other attractions on it as well. I was gonna say a perfect nod to the past. Yep. I love the characters. Can you name all the Mouse characters without looking? Oh boy, Larry, Maisie, uh, Chase, uh, Bob, Phil, Tina, Maybe, Donnie, uh, Marie. There should be a Tony. Uh, <laughs> there was no Tony, they never asked me. No, I, I tried to memorize them and I, I can't, I can't. There's too many. Do you have a favorite of them? <laughs> um, I, I'm particular, everyone's gonna say the cheese car. I'm a little particular to the cheese car because we were able to uh, reveal that at IAPA uh, in November for people to see it for the first time. First time we sat in it was there. I was the first to ride, you know, it my first time, which was great. And it's fun and fun and fun. So it was, it was great. How does that feel debuting the car at the IAP Expo and then finally like bringing it here and seeing the smiling faces on everybody? This is, this is what I love about the business because we spend so much time planning. You know, we, you know, you guys know this, we do years of planning in advance. We talk about great new rides, great new attractions. We have to keep them a secret. So when you finally get to get to the point where someone can physically see it, physically get on it, physically enjoy it and tell you how much they like it, or in some cases, maybe they don't, uh, it's this is the special day that we look forward to. And I can't wait, especially for this weekend when all of our regular guests will get to ride for the first time and seeing all the families riding it and the coaster enthusiasts. And um, it's a great addition to the park. I, I'm, I'm so happy we have it. I feel like kids are gonna enjoy this all the way up until their grandparents and everyone can enjoy it together. Yeah. Do you remember the first time you ever came to Cedar Point? Um, yes, 100%. It was back in 2000. Um, I was a, uh, I, I used to work at Great America in Chicago as a ride operator, uh, being from Milwaukee. So I had always heard about Cedar Point, but never had a chance to visit because I was too young. So when I was a little older, um, I was able to take a road trip to see Millennium Force for the first time. I was such a nerd. I followed, uh, Monty Jasper's blogs on the website. I, you know, I kept up with all the updates um, and then just getting here and seeing this place for the first time, I said, this is, this is like paradise. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta be a part of this. And now it's your home and you're- It is, I live here, I work here, um, I play here. This is, there's nothing like Cedar Point on earth. There really isn't. And it's, it's cool. I was gonna say, it's a place like nowhere else. I remember the first time coming over the causeway, seeing it, yeah. it was like a dream come true. Yeah, I mean, there's, all, there's always things that you know, people prefer as they travel and go to different parks and things like that. But I don't think you could ever beat the setting of this park. And that's what makes it truly special. It's been here for a hundred and this is the 154th season now that we're going to be in operation. The, the lake and the history that's here, the way that we've tried to tie in all that history, the great thrill rides and roller coasters that we build and have yet to build, um, all of that combined, it just, it, it really is a special place. I love it. I love it too, we all love it. So everyone needs to come out, check out the new boardwalk and ride the wild mouse. Congratulations on the opening of it. Thank you, thank you. Which uh, which row is gonna be your favorite? Um, <laughs> good question. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, you, you pay, pay. Yeah, I was, gonna, I was gonna see if you caught that, but yes, the back is the best. Left side or right side as well. <laughs> well, if you're by yourself, either side, I suppose, because that changes, the, yeah. Well, I mean, it's all about weight distribution. Right. So if you if you have a whole family of four, chances are you're not gonna get that crazy spinning. But if you're, you and a friend decide to sit on one side of the car, then you're probably gonna get kind of like a tilt-a-whirl, but yeah. on coaster track. So not as intense as a tilt-a-whirl, I, I guess I could say, is the spinning is not 
it doesn't feel like that when you're riding, but if you wanted that kind of motion, that's the strategy. Which is good that it's not as intense, so you can ride it over yeah. and over and slow down. And that's the, that's the whole purpose. There's all kinds of rides around here for families, and they can graduate up to things like Gatekeeper or Max Air if they want. They're all in this area, which is really cool. Yeah, it seems like terrific. They can start on Wilderness Run and then move up yeah. to this coast or an Iron Drag. And absolutely. Something for everybody. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for being here. Our pleasure.